All right, hello guys, and welcome back to my fourth episode of my Formula One 2017 career mode. This time we're going to Russia, Mother Russia. Oh yes. Now before I go any further, I just want to talk about that in my previous video, I talked about not being able to uh, bomb up the AI skill level while the uh, career mode was already going. But I guess the joke's on me, because you are actually able to change it while the career mode is already going. Apparently after finding a Reddit thread, uh, you have to do it the second you click career mode, then click tap in order to change the settings of the current career. Um, I didn't know about this and I think it's kind of well hidden. I think Codemasters could have done a greater job on that behalf, but oh well. I found it and I got to boost the AI skill level up quite a lot. So I think right now, I think it was 80% I'm at right now. So yeah, I'm not that far from 100%, which is my goal. So yeah, the, the results, etc. are also way more realistic now. All of a sudden I can really feel Sauber being one of the worst teams <laughs> like engine power is simply not there on the straights like the, the the AI is just boom way gone and uh, there's not really a lot I can do on straights etc so yeah it, it finally feels more realistic and that's the way it should be now running here in the background we have some of my uh, qualifying footage I did okay and and it, it's really nice to have bumped up the AI skill level because I immediately saw that my, my times were so much more realistic. I did have a lot of big mistakes, not only during the qualifying, but also during the main race. <laughs> For some reason my, my, my wheel started coming off the table, like no matter how hard I tightened it. It just kept coming off and I think it got to do with the coating on my table it's I really need to find a solution for that it's not really optimal but when you're driving <laughs> or maybe I'm just too violent I don't know like sometimes I, I tend to panic before a corner and I really pull hard on the wheel so yeah maybe I need to adjust my driving as well my goal is still to use this season as pure practice because if it were to be 100% realistic I mean Sauber would be last every single time so yeah my idea is that through this season I'm gonna bomb up the AI skill point by point and eventually be at 100% which I will do in my second season so uh, yeah that's my goal and of course also to get the racing line off but anyways let's uh, call it here and go to the race and uh, I hope you guys will enjoy the race and uh, yeah have fun guys after an exciting qualifying session yesterday let's take a look at how the cars line up Lewis Hamilton lines up on pole position and Valtteri Bottas will line up alongside. Looking down the rest of the grid we have Vettel, Raikkonen, Max Verstappen and Ricardo, Massa, Perez, Ocon and Roman Grosjean, Stroll, Hülkenberg, Kevin Magnussen and Sainz, a Sauber, Kvyat, Jolian Palmer and Fernando Alonso, Van Dorn and Marcus Ericsson rounds off the grid. Now it's almost time to lights out so let's go down to the track. Excellent job yesterday. We qualified above expectations. Let's go out there and put in a performance. Right, let's get the car up to temperature on this lap. We're learning the gears, so go through them all if you can.
is 2.2 seconds. of fuel left. Caution, caution.
Good job, mate. Really well done. That was a fantastic drive. So there we go. I think it was a pretty good race. I'm, I'm satisfied. I really am. Even though I did a ton of mistakes. Ah, oh, but hey, that's all part of the learning curve, right? Starting 15 and ending up as uh, 13. I'm, I'm pleased with that. Sure, we did get a position or two handed to us. Like, especially with the, the safety car. I'm not quite sure what happened with uh, Kevin Magnussen there. As soon as we got green flag again, he had an engine failure or something. Because he was right in front of me and he right away went off the track. So yeah, not quite sure what, what happened. But uh, that's one step further up the ladder for us. So that's great for me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna complain. Yeah, overall great race. Um, really satisfied. So coming up in the next video is gonna be my fifth race, which is of course Spain. That's gonna be exciting. I can't wait. I'm not gonna be able to play for the next few days because I'm really busy at work. So it's gonna be a few days, but uh, I'm gonna do my best to uh, get practice and all that done and, and get a video up. But uh, we'll see. I really want to thank you guys for tuning in and uh, hope you guys want to continue to watch my races and watch me improve as a driver because I guess that's mainly what it's about right now. Hopefully sometime in the near future I'll be able to go to the pro level. That's what it's all about, getting to that pro level. Big thanks for tuning in guys, I really appreciate it like I already said. And if you liked the video please hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe, I would really appreciate that big time. Hopefully I'll see you guys in the next video, take care guys.